Welcome to your channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I'm your host, Moharam Ghosh, and I'm back today with another very informative video for all of you. The video I bought for you today is about a 49-year-old man running a free school for children under the bridge in Delhi. He is fondly called as Master Ji. But before we go on to the story of this inspirational man, I'd like to share with you a brief about the channel Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I started this channel in May 2020. My mission was to inspire the present and coming generations to live by the eternal human principles such as honesty, integrity, respect for womankind, respect for diversity, respect for the elderly. Principles such as these are etched in stone and do not change over time and place. Towards this mission, I share with you inspirational stories of mankind at their very best on your very own channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant. We also have a Facebook group and a WhatsApp group which has about 870 and 210 members respectively where we share daily inspirational quotes. The link to the YouTube channel as well as the WhatsApp and Facebook groups is in the description. Please do join our mission. I request all those of you who have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do subscribe to the channel and join our mission. And for those of you, over 590 of you who have subscribed to the channel and are a part of our mission, my heartfelt gratitude. Coming back to our inspirational person, his name is Rajesh Kumar Sharma, a 49-year-old grocery store owner who is fondly called as Master Ji by his children. Hailing from a poor family of nine children in Uttar Pradesh, North India, he had a very tough time educating himself. For school, he had to cycle seven kilometers each way which took him one hour on a daily basis. He completed at high school, but when he joined for the BSc degree, he could not complete the same because of lack of funds. His dream was to become an engineer. When he could not complete his education, he moved to Delhi at that time, all of 20 years old, and worked as a street vendor, and then joined at a constructed site. At the construction site, he used to see young children playing in the rubble and he was shocked. First, he tried to help them with candies and clothes but realized that the, for them to overcome the cycle of poverty, he has to implement some long-term solutions and he thought education is the best way forward. He started teaching two children in 2006 under a tree. One of those two children today has joined college and hopes to graduate as an engineer shortly. 2010, he started a makeshift school for giving tuition to children under a newly print built bridge, the metro for metro in Delhi. Today, he teaches 300 children under that makeshift bridge. The children are from primary to secondary school. He divides them into two groups and he teaches two hours for each group. Boys in the morning 9 to 11 and girls in the evening 2 to 4.30 p.m. He also helps children of migrant laborers to complete the paperwork and get entry into government school at Shakapur, which is where he stays, which is five away, five kilometers away from his makeshift school. 
he accepts donations of clothing food and books for the children he also delighted to ex- accept school equipment carpets and he has been joined by seven volunteers additionally the school the makeshift school is located at the delhi under the delhi metro bridge this is the yamuna bank metro station in east delhi between the pillars with the roof with the bridge acting as a roof he has painted five blackboards on the walls there are separate toilets for boys and girls a little distance away from the bridge there are no benches they sit on scraps of carpets or on the floor and they do not accept funding from the government or ngos because they believe the ngos have their own beliefs and systems which need to be adhered to which would not work for these young children rajesh kumar sharma and his team of seven volunteer teachers teach them maths english hindi science history geography the children are also enrolled in the nearby school sometimes the parents are against enrolling children as the children can add a earning hand to the family but rajesh kumar sharma and his team of seven volunteers persuade the poor families to chal to send their children to school at the government municipal school at shakapur which is 5 kilometers away from the bridge the reason he requests them to enroll is so that they can get the benefits of free textbooks and the free bit day meal which ensures a nutritious meal for the children persuading the parents to send the children to school is a uphill task but rajesh kumar sharma a grocer by profession even takes that upon himself to ensure that the children come out of the poverty cycle he is also arranged for the children to play games such as kabaddi volleyball football and cricket on the weekends under the bridge he calls his initiative free school under a bridge rajesh kumar sharma a grocer by profession a teacher by passion a totally inspirational human being making a difference to over 300 slum children helping them break the cycle of poverty and become a part of india's growing middle class consisting of teachers engineers scientists a man making a stand making a change friends not all of us can be rajesh kumar sharma who can devote time to te- teaching 300 slum children enrolling them in school and helping them break the cycle of poverty however i am a strong proponent of the concept of difference to one it means we need to stand up we count it especially in these difficult times of covid 19 scan your neighborhood check out who needs your help make a difference to one person in your community your action will go a long way in mankind defeating this infamous covid 19 virus which has ravaged mankind taken away millions of lives and livelihoods you can and should make a difference friends i'm sure you find these stories which i bring for you very inspirational i request you once again kindly subscribe to the channel generous gracious and gallant please join our mission of ensuring the present and coming generations live by the eternal human principles i would also request you to share these videos with your friends and family and encourage them to subscribe to the channel and join our mission till we meet again very soon with another very inspirational video on your very own channel generous gracious and gallant good luck all the best stay safe